Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. We are in the last couple weeks of 2021 and winding down the last couple episodes of Budget Beauty Buys for the year. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for all your support this year. If you guys missed it, I uploaded the other day my top 10 makeup and beauty finds at TG Maxx and Marshalls for 2021. So I will link that here or also down below if you guys want to check that out. And today we are headed back to the stores, TG Maxx and Marshalls, and we're going to see what I can find today. I am so excited to see if we are still going to be finding new stuff. Is there any new holiday stuff? Christmas is just around the corner and I've been scoring a lot recently and I've been really happy to share everything with you guys so if you are new to my channel then make sure you subscribe I noticed a lot of people weren't subscribed I think it was like half the people who watch my channel and my mind was literally blown so please subscribe it helps out my channel it means so much to me turn on that notification bell so you don't miss out on videos I've been uploading every single day in December it has been a lot of fun a lot of hard work but I've really been enjoying it also make sure, make sure you guys tap the thumbs up button that helps out my channel so much I don't know why but it does so thank you guys for your support and let's head over to the stores <laughs> Okay guys, let's get into it. The first thing I found is the e.l.f. Electric Mood collection. This was just recently at Target. It's a collection they did with a bunch of different artists. And look how pretty this lip topper is. And this was only $3.99. This BH Studio Pro palette was like all neutrals. It was $14.99. I thought this was real pretty. And I was so excited. I found the Wet n Wild and Saved by the Bell collabs. This is the one they did with Kelly Kapowski. I was like... I couldn't believe it. This is only $3.49. I love Saved by the Bell. It's one of my favorite shows from growing up. So I was like, yeah, so cute. They also had this BH Cosmetics brush set. I also found, again, the Lime Crime Wet Cherry Wild Metallics palettes. Then I found another one of the Saved by the Bell collab items. This is actually the mascara. I literally just want this for the packaging. This was $3.99. And then here are some of the products side by side. I also found this e.l.f. Electric Mood eyeshadow palette. This was $6.99, also from that Target collab they did. And here's just a close-up look at the colors. It actually has some really pretty shades. And then this was like out of the packaging, the Lime Crime Venus XL palette. And I really like the color scheme in there. And then I found uh, the e.l.f. and Tovlo <laughs> Electric Mood Disco Kit. It was like a brow gel and like a glitter and a brush and this was $6.99 so I thought that was pretty cool and then you guys look what I found the glam light viva taco palette oh my goodness so you guys know when I went to Burlington and I found this so now if you missed out it's going to be showing up at your store so this was $14.99 and this is just the cutest thing ever I wanted to zoom in and show you guys the names of the colors because it was like cheese and cilantro such a cool palette and I found it twice. They also had the Jessie lip collab. This is a lip liner and a lip gloss or a lip matte lip and I couldn't believe I found all of them. Oh my goodness like this is the best. I, I'm living for the nostalgia. I also found a MAC Fluster Red lipstick. Moving on to another Marshalls, I found this Revolution and Jack palette. I don't know who that is, but this was $5.99. This was super cute. The BH Sweet Shop Bubblegum palette for $7.99. I found this Sephora ice roller, but it was actually like a body roller, but you could also use it on your face if you want to. So this was $7.99. This is a pretty vulgar plumping lip gloss in shade 117 for $6.99. Did you guys know that Cara Beauty actually has lashes? I didn't think I knew that, but this was only $3.99 and it matches their um, eyeshadow palette collection. This is actually a brand, Nug Beauty. They have good stuff. When I worked at Tweezerman, the CEO at the time, she created this brand. So, um, and I used to try a lot of their stuff. This was only $2.99. Then I found the Lisa lip set so I was like okay I finally found all of them <laughs> this is so cool I'm so happy this showed up at the stores this is another shade of the Kopari lip glossy 
I posted this on TikTok and people were like freaking out. And then Maybelline had this duo of their Total Temptation mascara for $4.99. I thought that was um, pretty cool. It was $2.50 per mascara. Some NYX primer pore filler. This is a set from Raw Sugar, which usually you see at Target. So it's a three pack and this is an organic product. And this was $4.99. I also found this Too Faced Hangover Pillow Bomb, which I was so excited about. This was on my wish list, so this was $5.99. I kind of couldn't believe my eyes when I saw it, so I scooped this baby right up. This is so awesome. It's like a, a lip balm. <laughs> That's what it looks like. And then I found the CoverGirl Clean Fresh Mascara, which is also a new find. So I do like the Clean Fresh line a lot. I have all, all mo the, mostly all their products that uh, then I found Physicians Formula. And these we've seen before, but the butter blushes are really pretty. I like this color because it was like a soft kind of pink and this was only $3.99. I found a NARS blush. The shade is Illicit. And that was $12.99. A MAC Dazzle Shadow. This was $8.99. This is an IBY City Limits eyeshadow palette for only $4.99. This is a new little set from Becca. It's the Liquid and Light Highlight Kit, and this was actually in the shade Opal. They had quite a few of these. It's like a little mini set. It would be a cute stocking stuffer. MAC NC25 Studio Fix Fluid. Sometimes I'll just kind of see these pop up randomly. This is $14.99 at the stores. This was such a cute set. It's a lip balm and scrub in pumpkin spice latte from iHeart Revolution. Really cute. That was $3.99. Another Kopari find. This is the Tropical Glow Cleanser. This was in the skincare section. So you can find some really great deals, you guys. A steal at only $8.99. Pretty. Oh, thank you. So are you. you. I love your headband and your bag. I was looking at it before. Oh, thank you. <laughs> You're adorable. Thank you. <laughs> You're so welcome. You. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Have a great day. You too. Thank you. So I found the Morphe Cherry Coke sponge set, which I've never seen before. This was $7.99 from their Cherry Coke collab. This is actually more of a recent launch. The Kopari Lip Glossy Pout Lip Kit. This had all these like tropical, oh, Paradise Pout. With all these tropical scents, there was pineapple. And I love the Lip Glossy. So I thought this was a great find. This was $14.99. This is another IBY find. This is the Cheek to Cheek Blush Duo in Rosie. This was $3.99. Here is a cool palette from Makeup Obsession. This brand was at Target. I don't know if it still is, but I actually did a video trying some of their stuff a while back. A classic MAC shade in Rebel. I actually own this one. It's really pretty for like the colder weather and the fall time. And then this is a matte lipstick in Act Natural. This is Sarah Happ, the Let's Glow Lip Luminator and the Nude Slip Lux Gloss. This brand has been showing up at my stores recently. And these are $9.99, made in the USA. And then I found the Kopari Lip Glossy in Birthday Suit. This was in my top 10 favorites of the year. Did you guys know also that Cara Beauty had an eyeliner? Because I had no idea. This was $3.99. Bare Minerals Bronzer. This is the Endless Summer Bronzer for $11.99 in Faux Tan. I actually found the original Venus palette, which I thought was pretty neat, from Lime Crime for $12.99. One of my favorite finds this week is the Too Faced Love Flush Watercolor Blushes. I think this was like a UK release. I did some research. This was $9.99. Really, really cool find. It was like a pretty peach color. I also found this BH Cosmetics Extra Bloody Mary Lip Plumping Duo. Also, I'm sorry my nails are not done. They look absolutely terrible. <laughs> I have to do them. I found this I Heart Revolution palette, which was cute, for $4.99 called Angel Heart. 
Lime Crime Unicorn Hair. This is actually like a glitter temporary hair color, which I thought was pretty, pretty fun. I love glitter hairsprays. I actually have one. <laughs> and this is Lime Crime Unicorn Hair, but it's like a, actually like a semi-permanent hair color. And then they also had this like orangey red color, but I'd have, I'd never seen these before. So of course I had to show you guys. And then they had this Eva NYC um, Gotta Balance Cream. This is a really nice brand. And then I found the Casey Holmes palette. You guys know I've found this for probably over the past year, but it's such a cute palette and it's only $7.99. I actually got this and like depotted mine. And then here's just like a Butter London nail polish set with four different polishes. They looked a little separated, but you could just shake them up. Okay, I found this Alterna like hair kit. So just watch what happens. I, I pulled out the product to show you guys and you can see it's very slippery and then I realize it's all over my hands. It made a mess. And then I found the Saint Tropez Watermelon Self Tanner for $19.99. And I actually also found this new Real Techniques brush that this just launched like a couple months ago. It's a collab they did with this Instagram beauty influencer who makes really cool videos. Her name is Victoria Lynn. So I was like, wow, I couldn't believe this was at the store already. The brushes are really pretty. And then I found another one of those Lime Crime hair colors. This was in Firefly. And this is like the sparkle thing I was showing you guys before, like the sparkly hairspray. And this was only $4.99. Hey guys, so I just wanted to kind of end off my video because, well, you guys know my car light is just so unflattering, but it is dark out now. So, oh my gosh, this was such a fun Marshalls shopping trip. I think we found total jackpot items this week. Those two new Too Faced items, you guys, I did get the Too Faced Pillow Bomb. I literally was so excited. I have been wanting that. If you saw my like Sephora wish list, that was on there and I am so glad I waited. I guess I just maybe figured it would show up at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. So I don't even care that it's like the mini size because I like actually having mini sizes and I literally waited online just to get that because i knew i needed it and actually i should put some on so that was honestly so exciting and finding the love flush watercolor blushes were also so cool i literally was shocked i was like oh my gosh it was kind of like hidden you saw in my video and i could not believe it and then all the save by the bell stuff that was so fun um, from Wet n Wild. That is one of my absolute favorite shows ever. I grew up watching that show. A lot of fun stuff this week. Finding the little Kopari set. I really enjoyed shopping and I hope you guys liked it too. Really such a sweetheart. I actually started to like tear up after she walked away because I've been actually having a little bit of a harder week. So she was like a little angel in my life. It reminded me of the scripture, like there are angels among us. And then I just got like really emotional. <laughs> I'm also like starting my period soon. So anyways, um, and then I told her I loved her bag and her headband. She had like this really cute butterfly headband and this like Hello Kitty bag. Precious little angel she was. So I just have to share that story with you guys because it was so sweet so um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed shopping with me i had so much on taking you along and that's it let me know what you guys found this week did you find any two-faced stuff comment down below i love chatting with you guys and i will see you in my next video bye